Hi everyone, welcome back. I thought today I would share a very personal part of me with you guys and show you my closet. I strongly believe that our closets really tell on us as people and the way that we manage our wardrobes can be reflective of all parts of our lives. Many people feel that the eyes are the windows to the soul. I think that a closet is a window to our internal realities. So in short, a messy closet is a messy life. I think it's really important to choose clothes that tells the right story about who you are. Every day you put clothes on, you're always making a statement with what you wear. But there is an expectation of how a fashion blogger should look like or how sh they should dress. I would say my style is a jean and t-shirt kind of approach. I just love the way things naturally wear and the way they naturally fall on your body and just form and become a second part of you. I love white t-shirts. I love cotton t-shirts in general. I have a lot of them as you can see. I love denim shirts. It's something that I picked up when I was living in Scandinavia and I love cashmere sweaters. They're soft, they keep me warm, they don't itch. At the end of the day, you know, I am an island girl. I was born in Dominican Republic and now I live in London. If you do not own a nice pair of boots, you have to invest in a nice pair of boots because that makes the outfit. During the winter months, the only form of high heel you'll ever see me in is my over-the-knee boots or my pointed ankle booties. If you notice, all my boots have either a pointed toe, if they're high heels, this is because this makes your legs look a lot longer and thinner. I'm a talent manager. A big part of my job involves me traveling all over. From all over the UK, Scandinavia, Europe and some parts of the United States. The traveling part, although sometimes it's difficult, it's highly enjoyable. That means I go to a lot of photo shoots, events, and shows. When it comes to dressing, I like to wear outfits that are just really easy and require very little thought. I tend to be in events very late in the evening and up in meetings very early in the morning, so the least I have to think about an outfit, the better it is. For the fashion show months, I tried to pack statement pieces like this special limited edition from Montclair and coat is my favorite. I can wear it over a turtleneck and just black leggings and it's going to make my outfit look fabulous. I always like to pack two well-tailored white shirts. It's just a perfect thing to put on in the morning when you got a hangover and you need to look sharp in a meeting. Packing for fashion month is quite interesting because if you try to look too trendy then you will inevitably fail. Because there are so many trendy people there. I find that the best is to stay smart and contemporary and stylish, classic and you know effortless. Not too fashionable. carry two bags with me, a clutch that I can wear at night and to more formal events and a big bag that I can stuff a lot of things into. This is my favorite clutch of the moment, it's by Christian Louboutin and I love the versatility of it, it's just plain black and these studs just make it look so cool. That's it for my closet, now I'll show you how I dress when I'm home. Hi guys! this beautiful silk kimono by a London brand called Ayamash. It feels incredibly luxurious against my skin, the silk, and it has beautiful lace detail all around the border. It's so feminine, makes me feel like a princess. 
I had so much fun filming today videos for you guys. If you liked it, make sure to hit the subscribe button and I see you next time. Bye.